Live at the Grapevine, this is the Kosher Spirit Review. I'm your host, Worth, and please introduce yourself. Steven Savage with Koval Distillery. And Koval, what's that? What's a Koval? Uh, Koval, it means uh, black sheep or in some ways uh, like a blacksmith. There's a family connection to both the distiller and uh, the wife of the distiller. And so since there was a, a family connection on both sides, here comes Koval, the product. Um, and, uh, hello, Sonnet and Robert. They are very good family friends, and I love them. And if you've never seen Koval liqueurs, just know that these are the best liqueurs I've ever tasted. I'm sorry. I know I promoted the products, and they're phenomenal. But these hold a special place in my heart. And, um, and of course, handmade whiskeys as well. Today, we're going to be reviewing uh, this one called 47th Ward. It is a mash bill blend, and I'm gonna also refer back to you, what's in it? It's a whiskey. It's a whiskey, it's American whiskey. It's a blend of four grains, uh, wheat, rye, oat, and malted barley. There's 12.5% wheat, 12.5% rye, 37.5% malted barley, 37.5% oat. Um, it's aged for just under two years in a dark charred barrel, and um, is delicious. Uh, our newest product and is winning awards all over the place. Oh wow! Okay. This is the second time I've ever even smelled this whiskey. And I'm using a really big glass because I want to get as much flavor in my nose as possible. I usually use small ones, so it's like everyone else drinking and tasting at home. There's this beautiful. Um, if you imagine taking platanos, the uh, big, firm-looking bananas that are about this big, and you you um, mash it down into a cream sauce, that's kind of a little bit of the attitude. Really slight, subtle. If you um, took that juice and put it inside of a, a lightly vanilla syruped wood, like you served it on a tray. No spiciness, which is kind of neat. It's, it's like this very soft, beautiful, if anything, some, some nice little herbs. And again, like someone slicing fresh cuts of oak. It's, it's very interesting how it is. It's not like an attack of all these flavors. Very subtle, lots of nuances. And again, this is not just some mellow whiskey. This is uh, what, 92 proof? Uh, yeah, no, 94. It's 47% alcohol, 94. so 94 proof. 94. L'chaim, to a good week, to a good Shabbos, and a good year. I, uh, Amen. L'chaim. Amen. Amen. Oh, cool. The middle pal of this particular drink has such an expansive flavor and the finish is rich. Again, you get more of that, that someone slicing oak, very subtle vanilla. For such a young whiskey, it's like two years old, do you think the, the oak could be more powerful instead of tempering? It's got, um, what is that? Again, nice viscosity, very creamy, but it's not thick. There's no sugary, syrupy attitude to the whiskey. For someone looking for a whiskey to go with um, ice creams, but then also turn over and go with soft herbal meats, it's got a very interesting combination. Forget mixed drinks, leave it alone. Leave it room temperature. You want to mix it? Ask them for a recipe book. That's right. Koval, 47th Ward, live at the Grapevine Wines. <laughs> with my friend here, Stephen Savage. Stephen Savage from Koval. I'm Yo Shilworth. This is the Kosher Spirit Review. Climb. Well said. Sure. Let's go.